Hello, so some sad news to discuss, which is the passing of Terry Downs. Terry Downs was a former middleweight boxer um, known as the Paddington Express after the West London district uh, where he grew up. Um, his record was, uh, let me just get this correct, this is from Boxerk, 35-9-0. and 0. And he was actually Britain's last uh, or oldest former world champion. Uh, he is seen to have been the lineal world middleweight champion for a period between 1961 and 1962. He famously defeated Sugar Ray Robinson, although, as Down said himself, I didn't beat Sugar Ray Robinson, I beat his ghost. This was 1962, so well past Robinson's prime. Um, so just wanted to discuss a little bit his record and um, and so on. Um, so he first won the British title from John McCormick, uh, the British heavyweight title from John McCormick at the Harangay Arena. Um, excuse me, he first won the British heavyweight title from Phil Edwards at the Harangay Arena in 1958. Um, he retained the British heavyweight title in the rematch against John McCormick in November 1959. McCormick had uh, defeated him that September at the Empire Pool in Wembley. Um, some big names on his um, on his record. He fought Joey Giardello in 1960, defeated Joey Giardello. Um, he fought a young Dick Tiger back in 1957. Um, and of course, like I say, Sugar Ray Robinson, he defeated in 1962. He had a trilogy with uh, Paul Pender. Um, he lost twice to Pender in Boston, however, defeated Pender in the Empire Pool in Wembley. Um, by all accounts, he was a really down-to-earth guy. He was good with charity. He had a great cockney wit. And uh, he was always a popular fighter with the public um, and had a total of 280 rounds. So that is the Paddington Express, Terry Downs. He also, outside of the boxing world, and this was quite common in the 60s um, for popular fighters, he starred in a number of films, not as a as an actor per se, but in bit roles as character, uh, as various, in various character roles. Some of those films include um, Fearless Vampire Killers, which was a comedy by Roman Polanski. Um, he was the hunchback Kukul. He also was in um, By the Shore in Singapore, 1967, Study in Terror, 1965, The Golden Ladies, 1979. Um, so just been looking up to find out what sort of other big names uh, from the UK are, are alive from that era. There's not very many. Um, Brian London uh, was British heavyweight champion for a period. Uh, he's now 83. Uh, he was a big name between 1955 and 1970. Fought Muhammad Ali in 1966. Richard Dunn, again one of Ali's um, opponents, is 72 now. The great Scottish fighter Ken Buchanan is 72. Joe Bugner, Aussie Joe, um, the British Australian fighter, is 67. Jim Watt, 69. John Conte, 66. So I've been trying to do research and find out what sort of other. Um, fighters sort of from the late 60s, let's say between the late 50s and early 1970s. If you know of anyone that I've admitted, uh, do let me know. I'm trying to do research basically and find out what prominent British fighters are still um, uh, sort of, so basically who is now the oldest former British world champion or former British champion. If anyone knows, please do let me know. So um, rest in peace to the Paddington Express, one of our greatest ever middleweights, Terry Downs.